what is going on? Welcome on down to Alan Muck, and today I am in my hometown of England. Yes, Rumasaya. This is where I live, and it's quite funny because today's video is about why I live in Malaysia. So I get asked every single day, Satya Pari, Satya Pari, bro, why you live in Malaysia, la? You done so nice, la? Well, today I'm going to tell you exactly why I live. In Malaysia. Alright, first up, the reason why I love Malaysia is, and you're going to be very surprised, because the weather is so beautiful. The England, Sangat Sujuk 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 Sujuk. Seriously, like, people think that England weather is so nice and cold. Some of our Malaysian TV crew came to England and they were like, oh, I can't wait for the cold, it's going to be awesome. They got there. Within one day, yes, one day, they were like, oh, we miss Malaysia weather, we, we want to go home. A lot of you Malaysians probably think the weather in England is so much nicer than Malaysia. <clears throat> Another reason, the food is so sedap. Oh my gosh, seriously. In England, the food is really nice as well. The difference is, it's much harder to find really nice food after 10 p.m. because all the shops are closed after 10. I can go to Mamak at 2 a.m. and order a tandoori and a garlic naan and it tastes so fit, it's so chewed, it's so tasty. I want to eat every single tandoori and every garlic naan I can find in Malaysia. But what I love about Malaysia is the choices of food that you get because it's such a diverse country. You've got Chinese, you've got Indian, you've got Malay and it all tastes like heaven in my mouth. In the UK, I have to buy all the food and cook it because it's quite expensive eating out and dining out. But in Malaysia, eating out, if you go to you know the local places, it's so cheap. I can get chicken rice for five ringgit. That's like 90p. I can only get a Snickers bar for 90p in England. Sayasuka, mine, bola, football. I love playing football. What I love in Malaysia is the futsal courts are open 24 hours a day. I have played football from 12 till 2 a.m. Yes, it's gila, it's crazy. Um, and in the UK, that would not happen. We only play football on a Sunday. Whereas in Malaysia, you can play football Sedia Pari. Sayachinta Beach. Sayachinta Pandai, I think. Sayachinta Pandai. And in Malaysia, it is home to some of the most beautiful beaches. And in England, right, our beaches are not good. That bolle, they are not good. The water is very dirty, it's grey, it's brown sometimes. The Malaysia Aya Sangat clear, blue, chanty. Another reason why I like living in Malaysia is because there's a public holiday like every day. <laughs> it's a good thing. I mean, public holidays, extra days off, bolle, bolle. Now in Malaysia, you guys have a lot of celebrations. Oh yeah, you guys know how to celebrate. You have Malaysia Day, you've got Madeka, you've got Hari Raya, Deepavali, Chinese New Year. And a good celebration means there's a party. Oh yeah, Hari Raya. You get to dress up in your little gorgeous Baju Malayu, have some nice beef rendang, Chinese New Year. I have got those pineapple tarts in my hand. I am destroying every single jar of pineapple tarts because I love them so much. Seriously, if any of you guys um, are from Malacca and want to donate me some pineapple tarts, uh, you can send them to my address. Pineapple tarts. Divavali, the fireworks are amazing. Um, the food, once again, just like Hari Raya and Chinese New Year, is fantastic. I'm not a Muslim. Okay, but I don't care. I will still go to the Harry Raya open house because if I'm invited, I will feel very welcome. Same with Deepavali. I'm not a Buddhist, but I still celebrate CMY. I have a great time, and that's a great thing about Malaysia. Okay, this is a really weird one. This is really weird. I love animals. I, I'm obsessed with animals, actually. In Malaysia, I love the fact that you've got these monkeys just chilling on the streets outside my condo. There's these monkeys that just chill in the bushes. And I think it's so funny, um, because in England, the only monkeys I see are at the zoo. Remember when I first came to Malaysia, I saw a monkey on the street and I was like, the monkeys escaped from the zoo. In Malaysia, you go to Tiamon and there's turtles everywhere. I was swimming with turtles. I can't swim with turtles in England. Um, yeah, that's it. Snorkeling as well, scuba diving. 
um, some of the seas and some of the wildlife, the fish as you see is just breathtaking. It's like, wow. So yeah, Saya Chinta, Malaysia. I hope this answers any of your questions as to why and what this Maxalay is doing in Malaysia. I love my country, I love England, um, but I also love Malaysia. And I think a lot of people don't appreciate Malaysia as much as they should because like I said, the beaches, the food, the islands you can go to, the culture, the, mult the multi-culture here is just really, really cool. You know, this country is awesome. So yes, be proud to be Malaysian and Sayajin to Malaysia.